we all did kind of a boot camp. Andy Dennis is our um, resident professional. You know, he leads us um, through through everything. We have an onset professional bobbin, but um, he's the one who started us off, training us on dummies. We spent every day for a while in the hospital working on dummies and then shadowing in the real ED, wearing scrubs and um, masquerading as med students so that we could see the real ED in action. Um, it, it's harder to shadow now because we're always welcome to go back, but now that everyone watches the show, they're like, we know who you are. The assimilation stuff was really fun. Um, you know, we learned like what song to sing in your head to have the right rhythm when doing compressions. Staying alive, staying alive. Um, we learned, you know, how to do an IV on a dummy. We learned all these really useful skills and how to do them quickly, right? So that they became second nature because once we got on set and you had to do it while saying your lines and emoting something, <laughs> it was like too much going on. So once we got the physical choreography down, it made the other stuff a lot easier. Um, once we started shadowing, the takeaway was a lot less fun. Um, people who work in the medical field are all superheroes in general, but especially in the ED in a place like Chicago, it's, it can be really difficult um, to see some of the things that, that happen in there. And so uh, on the days that I shadowed, I saw some really difficult things and I was just in awe. I don't know how um, how they do it every day. There must be a lot of self-care, you know, like ha having to go home and, and shake it off, shake off the connections that you've made with people, whether it's a gunshot victim or someone who, you know, comes in after an accident and their whole entire chest is <laughs> open. Sorry to be graphic, but I saw, you know, people with their body parts, like, hanging out of them. And, it was very shocking. Um, I don't like blood. <laughs> and even when I'm on set, knowing that it's fake, I'm just like, ugh. So um, I have a lot of respect for people who do this in real life.